A huge percentage of the murder cases I'm involved in have some kind of illegal drug distribution component. Drug policy kills more people than the drugs themselves. In 1900, when you could buy heroin in a Sears mail order catalog, the government statistics were that approximately 1.3 percent of the U.S. population had a drug addiction problem. In 2010, after a 40-year war on drugs, the government estimates that about 1.3 percent of the population has a drug addiction problem. The statistics are identical. 100 million Americans have admitted they've used illegal drugs. It isn't like a fringe element that's doing it. If you regulated them as a health issue instead of as a criminal, moral issue, you could much more effectively regulate them. When you talk to a group of people, liberal or conservative, old or young, and they listen to the facts, they come out of there saying, wow, this really is a crazy thing to be doing.